Hey everyone, so in today's video, what we are going to be breaking down is dribbling in NBA 2K21. And this is a great game to play, as you probably already know, but sometimes you just want to improve on your handles, and that's what we are going to do today. So, for quick crossovers, all you need to do is crossing over, hitting the right joystick, right and left. That's going to allow you to cross over the ball. Of course, that is the most basic thing that there is in this game. If you wanted to do a size up move, a size up move is a move where you can see what your defender is about to do and then you can beat them off of a different type of cross if you really wanted to. And to do a signature size up, what you need to do is to press and hold that right joystick forward. That in this case for Kevin Durant is going to be doing different killer crossovers. Now if you wanted to do a signature size up when it comes to the park, Outside, in this game, what you would do is to hold the L2 button and do the exact same holding of the right joystick. Now, of course, this is going to be a different crossover when it comes to the park than what it is on the court that we're on right now. From there, the in and out dribble is going to be holding the R2 button and then moving the... or pushing the right joystick between the right and left side. So if the ball is already on the right side, you would push it over towards the right. If not, then you would have to cross over to your left first to be able to do the, the in and out dribble towards the left side. Now, different players will have a better in and out. This is Kevin Durant. He's a small forward. He's not going to have the best in and out dribble. Now your main thing is to put different types of crossovers together so that now you can add them all in and be able to destroy your defender. So what you would do here and how I like to do a great crossover with at least Kevin Durant and other forwards is to do a double tap right. That's going to get us towards that right side with a little bit of a step back and then we would cross back towards the left side and then we would press the R2 button and we would then sprint towards the rim. So this is what this one looks like. So we're gonna go right, right, left, and then sprint towards the basket. Now this is a, again, a quick move that you can do. I also like to run with a small forward, a quick double tap right, and then a spin off. That's going to get us towards the middle of the court much easier and beat our defender, especially if you have a small forward. So we're going to do that right now. So we're going to go double tap and then a spin. And of course, it's not going to let me. So I'm going to. So here we go. We're going to double tap right and then we're going to spin. And then we're going to attack that rip. This is a great move to do with Kevin Durant. Clearly, he was not a very big fan of doing this move. But here we have Mitchell, who is a lot better of a ball handler anyways. And, of course, he can do that combination. Another great combination to do is a double cross and then a step back. So we're going to go and do a crossover right and then a step back. And then we're going to take that shot. So we would be normally walking towards our defender. And then we're going to do a quick, quick cross and then a quick step back. And then we're going to take that shot. And there is that move. That is a very good move to use, especially with a guard and can get you a ton of points. Now the mid range game is very important and that's what this next move is going to do for us. So in this next move, what we're going to be doing is quickly attacking the left side. You can do this towards the right side as well. And what we're going to do is we'll be attacking the left, quick crossover and then a step back and we're gonna take that shot. So what we're doing is attacking the left side, quick crossover right and then a step back and then we're going to be taking that shot. It's a fantastic move to do. Anyways, I hope that these moves have helped you become a better player in this game. If it has, hit that like button, subscribe, and I'll see you guys again next time.